Hey, what's up? This is Jake. You're in Jake's shop. Gonna do the underside of the hood. I actually went ahead and was just going to do the underside of the hood and not even a video on it. But I'm gonna use a company that does mobile blasting. Um, and I wasn't going to do that initially, but I had a little problem with this hood. The paint lifted. Uh, I'll, this is the one panel I didn't take to bare metal because of all the crevices in the underside of these hoods. It's just a nightmare to get to everything. The paint looked pretty good. I just you know, took it down to 320 everywhere and sanded it off really well. Um, didn't sand it all off. The paint was too wet when I shot it. The solvents got down in and the paint lifted, which is a problem. You can avoid some of those problems, I've been told, by just going lighter, um, taking your time a little bit more with the paint. And that way it's not too wet and it gets down in and lifts that paint up. But it happened to me in a couple spots. So I'm done with that. I'm not going to spend time, you know, eight hours sanding and scraping and doing everything to this hood because I still wouldn't be able to get in all these crevices. It just takes forever. So I'm going to try this mobile blasting company out. One thing that's kind of nice about new panels is, uh, you know, a lot of times they don't line up as well. You got to bend them and, and whatnot. Um, but the nice thing about new panels is you don't have to go through all this process. You know, a lot of times they just got that coating on them that comes off really easily with sandpaper. So. Anyways, we'll see what he does. We'll see what it looks like. We'll check out his process. Hopefully, he'll let me shoot some of it um, and throw it up on YouTube, at least uh, another step in the process of this car. You know, doing any things with these cars is just time consuming and trial and error, and this is a setback. You know, this is a setback that's probably going to cost me 10 plus hours and probably a couple hundred bucks in just paint materials that I've wasted on the underside of this hood. Um, and also his cost, you know, uh, he's going to charge me 150 bucks. Not bad, it's probably around the going rate, probably a minimum charge, it's probably gonna take him longer to set up the actual mobile blaster than it is to blast this hood. So we'll go outside after this, after he gets here, uh, coming over this morning, and we'll go from there. Okay, so we have Lewis and John here. The LS blasting. They're gonna go ahead and set up. They're gonna use a dry system on this hood now. So we'll get to see a little bit about what they're up to and how this actually works. They're great guys. They're actually local to the Olympia, Washington area. And uh, pretty cool they come over and get to do this. Take care of it for me. Like I said, once they get set up here, it should go pretty quick. So I'll shoot some quick video once they actually get to blasting. Are you watching, buddy? Okay, so LS Blasting came over and they really took care of the hood. Um, I went ahead and did a little bit of body work on a couple dents that I noticed. Um, nothing too crazy, but just kind of clean it up. And yeah, they did a great job. That, that worked out really excellent. I see no warping. You know, they adjusted the pressure on their machine to make it turn out, uh, turn out right. So on to some primer. And uh, yeah, hope you like this video. A little update on kind of what's happening out here. Got the fender wells all stripped. Going to be priming those next. And uh going ahead and just flat blacking those but we'll get this in the shop later and uh, I'll keep doing more updates thanks